And it looks like in the standing of the world, Russia is doing a lot and playing their part in restoring humanity to its full potential. And they are bringing about the Russian exposition in Moscow, and it looks awesome. They are glorifying the old architecture, the classical architecture. They're going old school and they're building massive buildings for this. They're inviting people and their crafts and their artworks from the native nomad regions all the way to the incredibly masterful artists that Russia has and has been putting out with their great art schools that follow traditional methods and do amazing things. They've got fountains, they've got the towers that look incredible, they've got the lights, they've got the exhibitions, they've got all the culture you could ask for, they've got tons of different things, educational paths, tours. It looks awesome. It looks exactly like one of the old school expos. And it almost got me thinking if Russia was the initial initial originator of some of these expos like how they claim that Greece has the Olympics I wonder if Russia and the Russian Empire the Tartarian Empire was the first to do something like this to bring the world together as one to showcase the skill of the world and bring things together if you were in a progressive world where you didn't have the West trying to constantly bring things down with their letter agencies and their disgusting evil that then you'd have things like this all the time all over the world where people would want to humanity would want to as a whole increase its standing and get better and better instead of stupider and stupider like they're happening in America like that our leaders are just drilling into us a backwards progress and calling it progress like all the things that they call smart which are actually toxic and dumb and pathetic so Russia seems to be doing it amazingly and they are taking what America and the West are doing to the world and they are dismantling it and they are showing the world what it means to be real and the, nothing that these American losers do to Russia seems to stop them at all. Russia continues to look better and better and if you notice here there aren't a thousand genders. None of those columns, those ancient beautiful columns are covered in rainbow flags. There is not people crying and protesting. None of these things are allowed and it's not that they're not allowed because of freedoms they're not allowed because they're stupid and they're run by encouraged by the nastiest people on earth which Russia expels in vast numbers so many countries are not participating in the trash and filth that America partakes in and encourages around the world and they're doing so much better for it look at 20 businesses and NGOs if that was in America the businesses and NGOs would be disgustingly corrupt it's there's something amazing happening in Russia the people look very happy they're unstoppable in that war they aren't even close to being corrupt even touched by Ukraine all this stuff all this media charade of Russia for so many years and look what they're doing they're doing beautiful beautiful things and maybe this is part of that censorship they don't want Americans to see oh wow look at what a great powerful country can do when they uh, don't accept the disgustingness that we're trying to put and pollute America with. So really impressive, really amazing. I just wanted to show you all this. Uh, I don't know where the future is going, but I hope it's heading in the direction of this, where they're doing things in amazing ways, very wholesome, family-oriented, spiritual, God, ancient, traditional methods, all kinds of cool things. Everyone joining together in harmony, doing great things, feeling a united power, and getting that old exposition feel back. And that's what this looks like. This looks like it has the old exposition feel, which I've always wanted to experience. Be incredible to go to this. I'm sure I won't be able to, but hey, you never know. Invite me, Russia. I'll do some art for you. <laughs> Either way, bless you all. Just wanted to show you this. Have a great day.